Ospreys. Happy Monday. Welcome to another news update on Inside Soup in 90. I'm Johnny Jean here to give you the Florida Rundown. First for today, a Florida teacher is arrested for child abuse against a student. In Jacksonville, Caroline Melanie Lee is facing a felony charge just two days after being awarded Teacher of the Year at Darnell Cookman Middle Slash High School. According to NBC, the police stated that Lee called the student into her classroom privately and proceeded to hit her in the face, causing her to bleed. Video surveillance shows her aggressively walking to her classroom right before the incident occurred. There are currently no court records yet. In other news, two of Florida's largest districts are easing up on mask mandates. According to AP, Orange County students are allowed to not wear a face mask if their parents provide a note explaining why. Starting today, masks will be strongly encouraged but not mandatory. And in Broward County, board members agreed to lift mandates but keep them in place for lower grade levels for kids 5 through 11 until a vaccine is available for their age group. And last for today, probation debts in Florida and in Mississippi are being erased. According to the Miami Herald, a private nonprofit group and a debtors union have bought and erased private probation debts for about 20,500 people. This amounts to nearly $3.3 million in debt, which averaged for about $159 per person after working with a debt collective. The name of the private group remains anonymous as it was a part of the conditions for the purchases. Well, Ospreys, that's it for the Florida Rundown on Inside Super 90. Remember to have an amazing day. I'm Johnny Jean, and I'll see you tomorrow.